Sean. Just something you might be me. How does that feel? Yeah, mate, unreal. Um, obviously, childhood dream of mine. I mean, of any young Australian boy to play for the Wallabies and to fulfil that dream tonight, yeah, it's bloody awesome. Don't have words for it. Really long time sitting on the bench there, kind of waiting for that moment, though. How would the nerves? Um, yeah, they're bubbling away. Um, I mean, we've had a few weeks uh, prep leading into this game, so I mean, felt pretty good that when I when I went on the field and just knew my role and tried to execute it. So yeah, all good. It's pretty exciting to have your family as well. Obviously, battles over in France, and I'm about to come to Olympia. Um, I asked her the same question the other day. But the Easy answer, her. <laughs> Not me. <laughs> Josh, um, a close game like that to come on, I guess, how much does it all like just sort of trust in your own belief and trust in it, sort of you're there for a reason, just to sort of make that difference in the end and play that a win like that? Um, yeah, I mean, not sure about make the difference, but um, yeah, we've, we've, we've been prepared well the last few weeks to nail our role in any sort of situation the game's at. So um, coming on, just had to do that. And yeah, luckily tonight we, I mean, not luckily, we, we earned it, but we came away with the results, so it was good. So can you sense that growing confidence amongst the group when you find yourself in those situations that, you know, players like yourself and, you know, the Debbie Thompson from last week can make that difference despite maybe not having that test experience? Yeah, yeah, I mean, we've all had uh, pretty big Super Rugby seasons. It's, Obviously, pretty competitive competition that puts us in good stead for Test match rugby. And I mean, physically, we we back ourselves to come in and perform at this level. So, yeah. Felipe, I bring you into this, um, getting a sort of a double like that. How special is it just for you just to sort of soak it all in at the sort of the place where you just sort of called home for, for 2024? Yeah, I was lucky to get those two tries from Tim. Team together, play together, to get those two tries. Like everyone played the role, so make it easy for me. And to be playing here in Melbourne, well, that's so, so, so special for me and to most of the boys, and even just make his debut. Yeah, it's really special. There's, there's a saying you create your own luck. Um, those chases, particularly the, that second try where you put the back back and get it. How much is that better focus or just sort of something that you live by when you play just to make sure you just give 110% effort and just keep chasing moments like that? I think it was our main focus f for this game and even the last game is to be like spark, whatever we do, like to get ready and everything. Yeah, I was lucky to get that tap back from inside from the winger. Yeah, I was. I was there, so I make the try. <laughs> did you, Felipe, when you studied that, did you know that that was a chance that they would try and tap that in? Or do you know what I mean? Like, you, did you think that could happen before <coughs> anyone else? So? Yeah, because you know the rules now, you can jump from outside yeah. to catch it in. So, yeah, it was like a good kick from Noah. Allow me to go, to go like for me to get there, and was lucky for the for him to tap it back in. And were yeah. you thinking I'm, I'm chasing this to tackle the bloke, or did you think he's uh, a chance to tap this in? I'll, I'll yeah, I was. I knew he was gonna tap it in. Yeah, right. yeah. I, I was like, it was a good like bounce from the ball. Yeah, I was a bit wet. Yeah, that's good. And. Um, in general, did you, I mean, you hadn't played Test footy for a couple of years, you played a lot um, back in like 2020 sort of territory. Mm. Did you think like that was it for you or did you always have confidence I can get back you know, at some point? Yeah, I, I was believing, believing in myself, like I can be back again. Unfortunately, like, I was happy to be back again after two years from international. Yeah, I was happy to be back again to be this team. And what's your, what is your conversations with Joe been like? Because you're popping up all over the field, like even scoring <coughs> the first try. That's not your win, right? So you're running around the field. What, what's your conversation with Joe been like about your role? What he says about 
to you can like give a license to to, to everything you want to do. So yeah, to make the trial from chip and chase from cows, it's pretty good. I was lucky to be there. Lucky phrase to pass it to me. Would you go crying if you didn't? Yes. <laughs> it's been a tough year for, for you and all the Melbourne guys. Is it, you know, is it nice to be able to move, move on from that and get to a happy place again? Yeah, it's a tough, like, what happened to the rivals and all things happen. So, need to move forward. To like back to the Reds. Yeah, I was happy to back home where, where it all started to play alongside some of the players that I've played like six years. Yeah, and to play tonight with Josh Ness, make his debut was special. Mm. Hey, this is for Eva Guy. Um, I'm not sure you're aware that um, Georgia being Japan over the same time you guys were playing. Does that reinforce just how dangerous they are when they're, they're on and they can match with some of the best names ever? Yeah, yeah, for sure. We know um, the, the threat Georgia posed next week. They're, they're known to be a big sort of physical side, especially up front. So we'll, um, we'll do our prep this week and our preview for them and yeah, hopefully be in good step for the game. Thanks, George. Appreciate it. Oh, sorry to ask you about Felipe. You guys have been known each other from back in the Reds days. Mm -hmm. like, is it good to see him playing for you with a smile on his face again? You know what I mean? Like, is that when he's, you know, at his best? Yeah, mate, definitely. Um, Lippo, as you said before, he pops up anywhere on the field. He's He's having fun out there, you know. You see his, you see the smile on his face, and I mean, when he's when he's picking up opportunities like he did tonight with the little tap back off the off the miss kick for touch, you know, Filippo's in good form. So, yeah, it's great to have him firing. He's awesome for the team.